Somewhere in this great cathedral, the heart of darkness lay concealed. The city outside was in chaos, and the cathedral would not be immune for long. During such times, buried secrets were often suddenly revealed, or lost forever. Hmm. Can't do anything about that, because Raziel cannot turn into a bat. Got nothing here. Can't, uh, don't have this power. Look through all those, don't have it. But whatever. Gotta move on. Avernus Cathedral was an area that we encountered in the first game. In the game Blood Omen. It was where Cain had essentially gone to after encountering the Oracle, looking for, um, looking for one of the Pillar Guardians. I think it was the Jewel. It is also where the Soul Reaver was kept. Eventually, um, the Soul Reaver, I mean, uh, Kane is carrying the Reaver around with him, but eventually it will find its way into Avernus. And from there, it will uh, be picked up by the younger Kane and used to kill the Jewel and eventually, uh, William just God damn it. But at the moment, uh, Avernus being in flames is a result of like uh, bandits and sort of a bunch of demons assaulting the town. Cain will eventually encounter these things, and they're going to be, and they're actually some of the more difficult enemies in the game because he can't, uh, he can't simply like feed on their blood or anything like that to regen his health or anything like that. So it was a pretty difficult part of the game, actually. Now Raziel. Uh, is under the impression that he's going to find the Heart of Darkness here. But, I mean, it's possible. A what? <laughs> I guess I gotta kill both of them. Oh, there's more than one. Die, damn it! You're pissing me off. down. Well, okay, while he was in there, though, he, uh, well, I don't have a, I don't have a way of finishing that thought. <laughs> Guess it really wasn't much of a thought then, was it? Why does it only hit one of them? <laughs> one left. Oh, no. It's dead too. Oh, 3D platforming. Gotta love it. Hopefully we can get this stupid reaver soon enough. And, uh... Finally get through those doors we've been looking at for a long time. Obsidian Spear. Yay, another warp portal.
I had seen this symbol throughout these ruins. I should have realized what it was they worshipped. Now there was no question, for this scene depicted the ancient vampires' torment and despair as their curse cast them from the wheel of fate. So this was the god whose abandonment had driven them to madness and suicide. Finally, I understood. It was not the bloodthirst, but their immortality that was the true nature of their enemy's curse. The wisest, strongest, most noble race, gulled by the voice of that old parasite. But I had seen him, and whatever he was, he was no god. The Elder God was the god of the vampires. It was this sort of blind devotion to the Elder God that led the vampires to fight in its name against the Hilden. And when the Hilden enacted their curse of immortality, the vampires became useless to the Elder God because all it really cared about in the end was things dying and their souls being transferred to the wheel and powering the wheel of fate, which was which was exactly what the Elder God needed to feed upon. So, even though they had their devotion, that didn't necessarily mean anything to the Elder God. What the hell? Ah, here we go, more of these guys. So the Elder the elder God did not care in the least about the vampires, and the vampires, even though they had their blind devotion, and even though they were willing to do whatever they needed to do to support the Elder God, to power the wheel, they essentially became useless to him, because they, the blood curse essentially gave them immortality. Now, sort of racked by this guilt, a lot of vampires decided to commit suicide. The suicide was in an attempt, probably effective, to an, an effective attempt to allow them to fulfill the only duty, the, the duty that they ever really felt was necessary other than uh, guarding the pillars. One down. But even this, uh, even this sort of devotion to sacrifice themselves for the wheel wasn't enough to appease the Elder God, because the Elder God doesn't really care about their, and doesn't really care about them at all. So they sacrifice themselves for nothing to a, appease something that doesn't care. And the Elder God turns against the vampires, has them eradicated. Which would explain, I mean, we all knew the entire time that the Elder God needed the vampires in the Soul Reaver era. To die because they were essentially immortal. With the human race being driven to near extinction, there wasn't simply simply not enough souls flowing through to power the wheel. I'm I'm not sure what the nature of this wheel of fate is. Whether it's actual like a physical wheel or what, I don't freaking know. You don't really go into detail about that. Maybe just metaphorical. You'll be dead soon enough, buddy. See, these vampires, the first Pillar Guardians, sacrificed themselves in an attempt to appease the Elder God or power the wheel or whatever. And even in death, I mean, their souls haven't, I guess, gone back yet. But even in death, they have this devotion that they're still trying to end Raziel for the sake of the Elder God. Okay, uh, I need to get back in the material realm. Let's 
got to be a way through here somewhere. Hmm. Where are us? Uh, no, that's not it. Haha. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, I'll have to remember this is here later. Come on now, there's nothing left to fight. You should not be hiding this thing. There it is. Now remember in this area there are a bunch of the um, weird monster things that block doorways. So you're gonna wanna go invisible. Ah, damn it. Damn, uh, resurrected demon things. Yeah, when you're not strong enough to pose significant danger, just throw more and more of them at you. I mean, we're not at the end of the game yet, but we're getting close. So, I mean, the, there's not a whole hell of a lot left for them to throw at you. So they're really just trying to ramp up the difficulty in any way that they can. This spirit vessel was shielded by layers of occult energy. There had to be some means to dispel this barrier. Yes, some means. Eh, already been through there. Here we go. One down. Where? Ah, okay. Damn tentacles. Bottom, jeez. Calm down. Okay, I think I need to go get juice stuff again. Oh yeah, waterfalls. I mean, they say not to go chasing waterfalls, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah, does this look familiar to anyone? Back in Kame's time, there was no uh, water flowing here. So where did he was? In Avernus. 
and then transfer it here. Then Kane was here and tried to get the Avernus. Oh look, the hole he made is in the floor still. Guess nobody really bothered to try and repair this crap. frozen. Chump. Gotcha. Uh, okay. Gonna have to get up there. Probably have to fight some more crap along the way. At least the camera angle's agreeing with me. Not that way. Damn it. Oh, never mind. As the Reaver absorbed the souls of the original Energy and Time Guardians, it was imbued with the elemental power of Earth with which their principles were aligned. Earth Platforms. How very Mega Man of you. Let's do that again. Yeah, wrong platform. Wrong, uh, power. Okay, that makes sense. It's got to turn both statues to the color I need it to be in order to um, get it to, uh, you know, open those doors. So I set both of them to this to get it to open the one on either side. So I might as well do this. Uh, 
Uh, it's just leaving me the one over here, didn't it? Yeah, I didn't need to be here. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna need to find my way over here. <laughs> Light some fires. Where's the, uh, there it is. Not sure that was necessary, but I did it anyway. No. Already did this one, didn't I? Guess that didn't matter, did it? I'm here to light fires, not uh here to light fires, not change those things. Whatever. Damn it! Two more on the other side. I'm not. Oh, maybe I can reach them from here. Shit. Okay, I gotta try that differently. Maybe I can get there like this. Yep. Kane could have jumped across it, but I guess Raziel can't. Alright, just gotta find that bastard and get out of here. If I can find it. <laughs> huh. Not where I needed to be. Where's this stupid portal? Tell me I'm locked in here. Damn it! It's 
It's gotta be up here, right? I mean, it's just gotta. There it is. After way too much time of wandering around like an idiot. <laughs> 